remind you about this book. Sorry, um, um, His Excellency, the Speaker, Honorable Speaker of Zimbabwe, I had the copy. This book is Undisciplined Heart by Jane Kachalili. It's a memoir of her life, and she practically documented all her life, line by line, in this book, speaking in this book. So if you want to know Jane more, you can read this book. But I want to, to, con to conclude, it's a conclusion of things. After we have launched the book, Jane autographed my book and said to Becky, dear friend, Thank you, with much love. It's a pleasure and joy and privilege for me to have been asked to be the director of ceremony of this memorial service to read how Jane opens this book. She opens it and she closes it with a Psalm 103 at the end of it, I think on page 300. Um, the book starts like this. The mountains do not pray. They are already a part of God's prayers. We nearly thought we have lost her when she had gone to Cape Town for open heart surgery. And then she came back and she gave a testimony right here. And God has extended her life with that pacemaker for 10 years and more. But Memorial service and burial service. May God continue to take you where you have believed you shall go. To Professor Peter, call him Professor Peter. That's very important. Or somebody can read it for me. Matthew five. These are what we call beatitudes. Into the Lord's most gracious mercy and protection, we have entrusted our sister Jane, and we now commit her body to the ground, earth earth, and her precious dust to dust. Ensure and certain hope of the resurrection to eternal life. Our Lord Jesus Christ, who died, who was buried, and rose again for us. We be glory forever and ever. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I heard the voice. I heard the voice from heaven saying, Write this. Blessed are the dead who died in the Lord and Blessed indeed, says the Spirit. And the stars begin to fall. Oh Lord, what a morning. Oh Lord, what a morning.
Bye. Bye.